It's quite cold now. The air conditioning is uh, really very um, low in temperature, okay? So you have gained so many insights today. Have you thought of how we can make use of our experience and intelligence and wisdom to create our own meaningful life? We only need one small step, one start. Passion. Light up your own fire. I know I like drawing since I have memory. I drew everywhere, even on the door. We lived in a broken wooden house that water could come in when there is typhoon, but my parents didn't care. I left school at 15, and my mom didn't stop me either. It's not that I hate study, it's that I didn't like the education system, because I tried to write my own answer, but I couldn't get any mark because it's different from the standard answer. So I started working and supported my self-study, things I like to learn. Uh, I went to design school and the teacher told us that uh, design is not related to art and we always had to work overnight. Later, I um, left school. When I was 19, I thought I was lucky. I got an office job. And I got stomach, uh, stomach uh, pain in half a year, and one year later, I got gastric ulcer. I stayed in the hospital for a week. I worked from 8 to 9 every day. Sometimes I had to work till 12. I rushed all the time. I thought I was like um, a, an ox. There was no life. Apart from work, there was, there was only eating and sleeping. So I got the idea that bad stress could kill. Even though I was willing to work hard, well, at that time, I could not bear any longer. Until I was 25, when I first tattooed on a real person, I felt a fire lighted up inside me, and I was feeling released. I talked to myself. That's it. That's the real start of my life. This is the profession for life which I was looking for. I felt like my life just started when I got my fire. This fire keeps pushing me to improve myself, be creative, and keep me excited and hungry for learning all the time, just like a kid. All I need to do is being me for the rest of my life, not for a certificate, not for my parents, not for money, but only to feed my curiosity. We all have this fire because it's the real you. It's the source of energy, but it has been hidden. We have to dig it out so we can see it again, so we can shine. And you can see your path so clearly, and it's full of chances. How can we lose ourselves? We grow up to our parents' standards. We worked hard, we went to school by society's standards. Soon we worked for money by our life standards. So we don't know or we chose to forget who we wanted to be 
and there is only either material life or virtual life. So we chose to forget who we wanted to be. The harder we work, um, the deeper our um, ourselves were hidden. So we have to be concerned about what we really like. We should not be afraid of changes. We should not be afraid of trying new things. You have to give yourself a chance. And then gradually, um, there will be the chance that you will get your fire back. I'm sure each of you can do it. The original self will reappear. And then that's the real start of your life. Thank you very much.